Let's find the area of combined rectangles. When you find the area of combined rectangles, first you have to find the area of each section of the shape. In this shape, we need to find the area of this rectangle and this rectangle. We're going to use the formula base times height. The base of this rectangle is 10, the height is 4. So we'll multiply 10 times 4, which gives us 40 square meters. Next, we'll multiply the base times height of the second rectangle. We know that the length of this entire side is 20 meters. That means that this side must equal 10 meters. The base of the rectangle is 10, the height of the rectangle is 2. So we'll multiply 10 times 2 to get 20 square meters. Step 2 tells us we need to add the two areas together. 40 plus 20 equals 60 square meters. The area of this entire shape is 60 square meters. Here's another example. We need to find the area of each section. The first rectangle and the second rectangle. We know that this entire side is 20 inches. We see that this portion is 12 inches, so we know that this portion must be 8 inches. I'll multiply 8 times 5 to find the area of the first rectangle. 8 times 5 equals 40 square inches. Next I'll find the area of the second section. I have 12 times 6, which is equal to 72. Now I need to add the areas of each section to find the area of the entire shape. 40 plus 72. The area of the shape is 112 square inches. Let's take a look at this example. In this example, we cannot see the two sections defined. We need to divide this shape into two separate rectangles. There's different ways we can divide it, but let's divide it here and find the area of the first rectangle and add it to the area of the second rectangle. In this first rectangle, we have five times six, which is equal to 30 square yards, and we'll add it to the area of the second rectangle. We can see that this entire side is 15 yards. This section is five yards, so this section must equal six, 10 yards. So we'll multiply 10 times two to find the area. 10 times 2 equals 20 square yards. Now let's add the two sections. 30 plus 20 equals 50 square yards. The area of this shape equals 50 square yards. Here's another example where we have to make the shape into two separate rectangles. We'll divide the shape here and find the area of the first rectangle and add it to the area of the second rectangle. This entire side is 10 inches. We can see that this portion is 6 inches, so we know that this section is 4 inches. That totals 10 inches across. First we'll multiply 7 times 4 which equals 28. Next, we'll multiply 8 times 6, which equals 48. 
and we'll add the two areas together. 28 plus 48. We get 76 square inches. The area of the shape equals 76 square inches. And this concludes our lesson on area of combined rectangles.